Hey everybody, so I'm here with uh, Gigi, which is my Gianna, um, and I'm going to attempt to get her dressed. Let me see what I can do, get her in a better angle of the camera. Um, <laughs> so I was going to get her ready and then just do a, you know, video outfit of the day. And then I said, you know, I'm I'm trying to record as much as I can while I can. Um, but I was thinking to myself, I was looking at her and I'm like, you know, while she is still, you know, a favorite of mine, she has a sweet spot in my my heart. I really love my Gigi. You guys know I have put her up for sale and then I was like no 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 <laughs> I can't sell her and stuff and then I couldn't rule her for the longest it took me forever to paint her and I finally painted her then it was I'm telling you I need to stop bringing hair in 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 my nursery this is this is why a lot of people like oh want to see the babies in progress and as you go this is why I don't do it because it 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 takes me a while to get rid of all the damage that it caused having hair all over the place but anyway um and i was thinking like a lot of people you know when i say i want to i need to sell a baby or something like that um a lot of people be like oh you know automatically assume i'll sell like my oldest baby or something like that now don't get me wrong these aren't real babies so if you know we're ready for an upgrade and we want to you know get a new baby you know we we tend to get rid of one that might be older or that we're not really into or we've had you know for a while that we're like I said we're not really into as much anymore I mean I'm still into Gigi of course but um just saying that's you know something that people might do and that's okay because it's not like you're saying oh you know I'm getting rid of my oldest child because <laughs> I just had a new baby these aren't real kids these are these are dolls so we can do that um but I think also at the same time some people don't understand like why I may decide to keep her over one of the newer babies um or over one of my, let's say, you know, big name sculpted babies or whatever. Um, and not saying that I think, uh, of course, I think Kathy and um, Jennifer is going, is getting more popular and known. Um, Silicone Studio is, you know, more and more people are starting to, you know, have their babies in their collection. But you guys know what I mean. So, um, and I think, you know, the community is just not used to that. And some, some of, parts of the community is not even ready for that conversation because a lot of people won't admit to the fact that they tend to buy what's trending or what their friends in their circle have. And so when someone decides that they don't want this thing that everybody else have or you know it's like you know it's like don't get me wrong I love Laura by Bonnie Bonnie Brown but it's like when you hear somebody say they don't like Laura you don't like Laura <laughs> by Bonnie Brown like it, it, it almost sounds like it's a sin right to some people because of course you know we are accustomed to yes yeah, she's still there um let me move her. She's she's not gone yet. So of course, of course, of course. Oh, come here, Poopa. My sweet little booba. Put you over here with um uh, I can't even think of his name. Jonah. <laughs> I'll put her over here by Jonah. But um yeah, we can't even fathom someone not, you know, chasing 
Hold on. All right, yeah. My lighting settings was driving me insane. I couldn't take it no more. Um, but yeah, we, it's like, you know, we cannot even fathom someone just, you know, falling in love with a baby just because, or, you know, a, a baby that's not, you know, on everybody's channel or everybody's page, or there's a whole fan club group page or this or that. And speaking of that, I, anyway, hang on, I'm not going to speak on that. <laughs> Actually, I'm not going to speak on that. Um, but yeah, it's, it always, it always kind of tickles me that people are still stuck in that mode where it's like, they expect you to, you know, be in love and follow the, the same trend as everyone else. And that's just, you know, it's just not my thing. Oh, this, how do I get this shoe on? There's no snap. Oh, I got to slide it on the foot. Okay. I, well, the good thing is the strings expand. Okay. So that's, that's easy. But, yeah, so I'm one of those people, like, there, I actually enjoy having kits that other people aren't that everybody's not running to get like i sometimes you 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 have a baby and you share it because you're so excited about it and i want other people to know oh this is where i found this baby and you know guys you guys can save money and still get you know a really nice baby from so and so so you know i'm like i share because of that because i'm like excited you know plus i remember you know when i first started collecting like not really knowing where to look to find, you know, more reborns or, you know, I went on eBay. That was where I, you know, the main place I would go and look at babies. But then I realized, oh, people have Facebook groups and, you know, all this stuff. And then I started because of somebody I followed on Facebook, I followed them to their YouTube channel and then I discovered the YouTube world. So, you know. I, I like to keep that stuff in mind and so I like to share a lot <laughs> probably more than I should so only thing about having this boppy up under this cover is that I can't really move them as freely as I like sometimes but let's see so yeah so anyway I'm just you know saying in this video I just want to say it's okay if you like something different than the the trends or the crowd or you have a baby that for you it works for you and it might not be everybody else cup of tea um for me I know like I like the billy body style better than um this body style um but it's still a nice body and i still really really um love my Gigi. like i don't know as Gigi is not when i think of like who i'm gonna sell who i'm gonna sell Gigi is not one of the ones that i think of i don't really think of her as a baby to sell um Gigi or Nori stuff like that I don't really think of selling them um, and I know like I said it it might come across as very different for a lot of people because a lot of people think to themselves like I would sell them over you know like someone like Vegas or Phoebe or you know that type thing um But I just get attached to my babies for whatever reason, different things, different sentiments behind it. And yeah, um, as I started collecting more, I also kind of try not to get too personal with 
like sculptors and um, artists that I buy from because I'm a very emotional person and I, the way I collect is when I stop liking you, I stop liking everything you do. <laughs> I mean, I might still like it um, from afar, but I don't want it in my collection type thing. So, um, I'd rather not get that personal with a person that deep into the, to the hobby until, you know, it's going to take away from the art itself. Cause really at the end of the day, it really should be all about the art, not about, you know, who's doing what, who's, you know, friends with who and all that other drama that goes on in this community um i should be able to see a baby like it if i got the money to buy it buy it i don't want to know what your religious beliefs is i don't want to know how you feel i don't want to know how you live it's it, you know the only thing i do appreciate is if somebody is a you know maybe have some demonic <laughs> belief system or do witchcraft or something like that like please go ahead and show us that and display that so i can gladly pass by your stuff and not buy it because baby that's one thing i don't want to invite in my home um but i believe that my energy and the the vibes that i have in my house will counteract that stuff if it come in here anyway or I'm gonna immediately want to sell it as soon as it reached because something about it is gonna give me a bad vibe. And I've had that before. I've had that happen before where I've bought a baby and it's like, oh no, gotta go. And I couldn't figure out place it, like why. So, yeah. But anyway, I just thought I'd put her on this cute little summery outfit. I was struggling if I was gonna put it on her or Phoebe, but um, I decided I wanted to put it on her. She's such a you know big girl and I initially thought her and then I was like oh that co those colors would look good on Phoebe too so I may actually go buy another one when I'm out because the reason why I haven't sealed the box on the other baby um my cuddle that's here is because I have an outfit in my closet for my personal baby and I kind of want to get her one so I probably will um run up to the store today and grab one for her to go in her box and so I decided not to pack her all the way just yet and then um I'll probably just grab Phoebe one of these outfits too I have some similar shoes to these two another pair so she could always have similar shoes on too but yeah I I didn't buy these shoes at the same time. I actually forgot I had these shoes hanging up in the closet from months ago um, in the other uh, closet, in the other room. So I was like, ooh, I like these. And I brought them in here and then I saw the outfit. I was like, oh, they, they can, she can wear that with that. So anyway, that's Gigi. Um, I will see you guys later. That is what she's going to wear for today. I'll probably snap her a few pictures, of course, for Instagram or um, my page, Miss Rennie Smith on Facebook, and go from there. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.